We go out early morning hours when the sun is rising and watch for dolphins, searching for them. Being with them in the group and following them is very interesting. What do they do? Where do they go? And uh, this gives us a really deep insight into their secrets. A typical day of research um, means searching for dolphins. If we are finding them, we are um, taking GPS data, we are looking for certain behaviors, if they are resting, socializing, foraging, and we are taking notes also how many dolphins are around, the composition, how many females, how many calves. We are diving with the dolphins, so that gives us the privilege to actually also know their personality. And uh, from the behavior, even you can see who it is. Every dolphin uh, is different. Some they are more shy, some they are more curious. They also recognize you on the water after this time period and you cannot be rude when they're coming to you, greeting you, whistling. You also have to say hello in your own way because then when they start to be normal again, calm down, then this is the part which is very interesting. What do they do? Where do they go? Being with them in the group and following them, we also observed a very special behavior. We saw the dolphins uh, rubbing themselves on a special coral called Gorgonian coral, where they rub their body into it, from their side, from the belly, from the back. They even stand up in a queue, coming back again, waiting for their turn. So there's kind of um, a tolerance to wait and then go through it. So that means something must be really special. Why is this so magical for them? So we were really wondering why do the dolphins rob on these corals. And we know from previous studies that the Gorgonian corals have this um, mucus layer which has antibacterial and antifungal properties. Now we know that the dolphins are using the reef not only for sleeping, also for other behaviors. This also shows us the relationship between the reef and the dolphins. So for dolphin conservation, it's very important not only to protect the dolphins, also their environment, the reef. From uh, studies we know that um, corals and other marine species contain chemical substances and of course it also could benefit us, but um, we have to be very careful to find the balance that we are not destroying the reef, the environment for the other marine creatures. Mm -hmm. 